The city's progress toward getting out from under the federal consent decree over the NOPD had a setback last year. The internal investigation of Jeffrey Vappi, a member of the mayor's security detail. Today, some of those same issues are being raised again in a fresh new complaint to PIB over Vappi and the mayor. Investigative reporter Mike Perlstein has the story. If a picture is worth a thousand words, this April 7th photograph of NOPD officer Jeffrey Vappi at a restaurant with the mayor could lead to far more than that. The last time there was a complaint about Vappi's hours and duties guarding the mayor, federal judge Susie Morgan issued a 76-page ruling blasting how the department handled the case. If he's seated at the table, he doesn't know what's approaching the mayor from behind him. In filing this fresh new complaint, Rafael Goyaneci of the Metropolitan Crime Commission points out several potential violations of NOPD policy. Either way you slice it, whether he's on duty or off duty, I, as I see it, I think that that is a violation of departmental rules and policies. Goyaneci says if Vappi is on duty, he's not following standard protection procedures and could be getting preferential treatment. If he's off duty, there's a potential problem with this department policy on nepotism and employment conflicts. Independent police monitor Stella Cement agrees that the photo should be taken seriously. Questions will be asked about whether or not he was following the standard operating procedures. Cement said the previous VAPI controversy led to an NOPD promise to do better. Supervision and um, adherence to policy should have increased in light of everything that was brought to the court's attention. Given the judge's criticism last time when the investigation was handled in-house, Cement believes the NOPD should allow an outside agency to look at this one. In order to ensure public trust and a compliance to the misconduct process, it should be considered for outsourcing. Mike Perlstein, WWL, Louisiana. We reached out to the police department and the mayor's office for comment, but they haven't responded. However, high level sources tell Mike that the NOPD is likely to give this investigation to an outside agency.